Hey, what's up guys? This is Cohans1973. Um, haven't posted a video in about a week. I'm probably going to just be doing um, postings maybe like once a week, try to make the videos a little longer, and just give you a recap of all the mail I've gotten during the week. So um, the first piece of mail I got I want to show is from um, a fellow YouTuber. It's my first YouTube trade, so I'm pretty excited about that. It's from 13 Gold Glove. Um, that is Maya, in case you guys don't know her. Maybe a lot of you guys do. She already has a lot of um, subscribers, and it's nice and refreshing to see a young lady involved in the card collecting. And um, she's actually very well-informed and a serious collector, so definitely go ahead and check her site out. Um, I saw a box break she did, and I saw that she pulled a Paul Gasol jersey card, and I like to PC Paul Gasol. So um, I hit her up with the trade. Um, I sent her a Donnie Avery jersey. Um, if you check out the video, you'll see what I sent her on her channel so um this is what she sent me in return first we'll go to the little note uh thanks for the trade maya 13 gold glove so cool i'll definitely save that and hope to do a lot more trades with youtubers in the future this is um she's wearing a couple extra she obviously saw my channel and saw some of my videos and uh ryan matthews rookie out of sage hit pretty cool um, Antonio Gates out of Epic, and uh, Sean Merriman out of Top. So, um, we'll all go into the Chargers PC. I collect all Chargers cards, so definitely appreciate that. And here is the card that we traded for. A little bit of a glare, sorry about that. It's Pal Gasol, Rookie and Stars, and it is 19 out of 99. So, Thank you for that trade. Definitely appreciate that. Hope um, you like what I sent you. And let's see here. Um, I got this actually. The first thing I ever purchased off of Amazon. My sister sent me a Amazon gift card for the holidays. And I got this box set of the series of ESPN 30 for 30. So I'm sure most of you guys are familiar with that. But I'm real stoked to get that. This is part one. And it has the first... I guess it's got a volume one, and it's got one through fifteen on there. So definitely stoked on that. Should be some good, uh, good entertainment and some uh, real good movies on there. Okay, I got a golf ball back this week, real nice from uh, Steve Stricker. So I'm stoked to get that. Sent that out what last week or something like that. I got that back, so I'm stoked to get that. Steve Stricker is an awesome golfer. Um, He's been around for a while. His career took kind of a nosedive where he's basically off the tour and he had to go and he had to re qualify. And he's made an amazing comeback the last few years. So, um, anyway, Steve Stricker definitely stoked on that. Um, here's my some of my my first TTM James Earl Jones. And that is from one of my favorite all time movies, Coming to America. Awesome picture. It's not as clear as I wanted the picture to be, but um, you know, it was a good picture and I had it printed out. And then here is James Earl Jones again. This is from Field of Dreams. Um, James Earl Jones has been around for a really long time. Um, he has a very distinct voice and he's in two of my favorite movies. If you have not seen Field of Dreams, uh, I definitely recommend that you see this. Um, this movie, it's a baseball movie, and then um, it's just a movie about life. It's an awesome flick, and um, it's a very important film to me. Here's one that everyone's been getting back. I'm sure you guys have seen this. Um, Rich Goose Gossage. I want something one. I didn't, you know, I know that he used to charge, and sometimes he does charge, and I did not want to be greedy, and awesome photo. I think this might be the same photo that uh, Mike has from the Autograph Network. But anyway, glad I sent that out and definitely stoked in that return. Here's some other ones that uh, Mike actually sent out. Um, huge fan of The Godfather. So, we got Abe Vigoda. With Andy next to Al Pacino. He did a 2 of 2. This glare is killing me. And here is the other one. So, real nice. And... Unfortunately, I got my return from Lance Allworth. And as you can see, no signature. Wah, wah, wah. I did receive this letter from Lance. 
And if anybody wants anything from Lance, these are his going rates. A little bit disappointed, but what are you going to do? I mean, I definitely want a Lance. All worth autograph, but he's charging fifty dollars just to do a card. So, you know, he's got a few certified cards, so I could probably pick up one a certified card off of eBay or at the store for a little bit cheaper than that. So, a little bit disappointed him. I saw Lance All Worth Success on a website, but I don't know if you know they didn't state that they paid for it. And sometimes people, unfortunately, they post successes to wrong addresses and so forth and they post successes when they're not really successes because for whatever reason they get some type of entertainment off of that anyway guys i'm going to be putting a sub contest together i'm trying to get 50 subs so um look out for the video for that and thanks for watching